Lisa sharing life stories with you. I got a little haul from Dollar Tree. Pretty good size haul. I thought I'd try these English muffins. They feel really fresh because I just threw a whole pack away from last paycheck to, from Walmart and it made me mad. I got all these really good uh, paper plates. Paper plates are a lot. I got two boxes of these peanut butter crackers. My husband likes peanut butter crackers. I'm going to get him Ritz when I go to the store, but I got him that for now. I know I'm missing stuff because I got two of these purple shampoos. And I don't know, it says no phosphate, no, let me see, silicone. Sounds actually good. No sodium, laurel, sulfate, whatever. Infused with coconut oil, purple shampoo. Kind. What does it say? Kind in brass tones and blonde and gray hair. Well, that's what I need. I got another one in my car. My husband always says he loves butterscotch pudding. Let's see. A liar pants on fire. There's my damn Reese's, my thing. I got two of these for me. The shave gel. I like this shave gel. I used it before. It kind of burns, but I still like it. All these little Dawn dish soaps. And I got a whole bunch more of these in the refrigerator. Protein boost. I gave my mother-in-law one so she wanted. She can have more if she wants it. I go through a lot of rubbing alcohol because you use it all over the toilets to keep them clean. Because my husband is like a dog. <laughs> I love them, but like a dog. And I got a bunch more packs of these tunas in the fridge. These are for the cats and us. My one thing that I really got out here for me, the last four or five bags of Andy's mints that they had, I love them. I swear by Dollar Tree's uh, Buddy's Heavy Duty Scrubbing Sponge Pads. These are really, really good. And then they soften up, and then they're easier to use. I highly recommend those. This is a deal because this is a pretty big bag of um, mashed potatoes. I got four of them. I got two of their Dollar Tree cutting boards because Chris from Base Can't Chris uses them. I thought, you know what? I got two of them. That's good. I got four chicken rice aroni because I love rice aroni. I, I got these pistachios, but my friends say, oh, don't get them. Unless they're peeled, but maybe I can change her mind. They're free. I got this Harbo Berry Clouds is new. Gummy. Harbo Happy Cherries. Berry Clouds. And only one of these. Fantastic Mix. I'm going to give her two bags, see what two bags she wants. I'll keep two and I'll give her two. And I got a whole bunch of this Rachel Ray Nutrish Cat Food. I put about four or five ones out already. They already have a ton of food out there, but I put um, two bags of that. What is that? Treats? Let me see. We're going in here in the dark, guys. Bear with me. And I got a ton of batteries that I definitely need. And these are name brand. These are Energizer. I'm giving some to my friends. What is this? These temptations, all these cats that are strays, I've used other treats before, you guys, but they, for some reason, the temptations, they lose their cat minds over. I don't know what's in them, if it's cracking them, but they love them. I got a whole bunch of the off-brand batteries that they carry and all these name-brand ones. I'm going to see if my husband wants any of these for his lights and stuff outside. He's going to be excited about that. I'm going to tell him if what he wants so that he can use but don't keep him outside because it'll ruin the battery and i got myself a bag of andy's cheddar fries i know it's dark in here and uh what else oh and i couldn't even believe this you guys i shit in my pants when i seen this these are four and five dollars at Dollar General and stuff like that. This Good and Fun brand. This is a brand my dog loves. I got about 15 bags of these 20 bags. This alone. Now I don't have to buy him no dog treats. This check. So I'm very happy about that. And I wanted to tell you guys. This I'm like between a rock and a hard place. I might lose my job. I'm supposed to lose my job. Shh. Shh. Supposed to lose my job. But I'm going to go try this factory out. Oh, and I forgot. I got these really pretty oven mittens. 
and these three new towels. I gotta wash the stove up. I forgot to get baking soda, but those are really pretty for spring. They match the, aren't those towels pretty, Pat? Aren't those pretty? Yeah, you just told me to shut up. No, sh I'm making a video. Oh, yeah. I didn't tell you to shut up. I'm coughing. I'm trying to talk. People can't, I can't be loud. He's, my husband's sleeping and he's sick. But anyways, these towels. I got her a bunch of stuff. I, I got her like 15 bags of candy. She's spoiled. Like, believe me, you guys. She's a brat and she's spoiled my lover. But she's bad. <laughs> but anyways. This is the deal with this. I'm between a rock and a hard place. I want to try to do good for my job. I'm going to take this job, but I don't know if I can do the walking. That's what scares me. Because I walk with a really bad limp because I got sciatica. I'm going to give it my all. I'm going to not do nothing wrong. I'm not going to screw up or do anything. I'm, I'm going to try to honor my job and make us look good. But I don't know if I can handle all that walking. So my thing is, can I collect unemployment if I can't do the job? So I don't know. I'm between a rock and a hard place. I'm trying my best in this world. So if I don't take it, I, they could deny me unemployment anyways because I refused a job. If I take it and I can't do it, I don't know what happens, but I'm going to give it my all. I just trust God will help me. And you guys say prayers for me. I love you all. This is my Wolfie. He's bad. He wants to go out again. This whole kitchen's tore up because plumbing all week. See? It's just crazy. We're trying to do our best. This plumbing costs so much money. It's money we don't have. Lisa sharing life stories with you. God bless you all. Say prayers. Say prayers for everybody, not just for me. I don't need prayers. Just need love. I just want a job that I can go to every day that I could make a living off of. That's all I want. That's all I want is to provide food for my family and have a decent car. That's all I want. And it seems almost impossible anymore. But I'm trying. So I'm going to give it a whirl, see what happens. Lisa sharing life stories with you. Look how my dog's waiting to go. He just came in. He's driving me nuts. Whoopee. I'll let him out again. But this is the last time he's going out. Okay, I love you guys. Check back tomorrow because I'm going to go to Walmart and get groceries. There's my husband's stupid racing car tires. And there's a pump. He's got a pump underneath the house. There's water. And there's a nice step stool I found on the garbage curbside shopping like Frugal Daddy because I had two step stools. They're 30 and $40 a piece. He lost one years ago, and the one he used because he's short doing trucks and stuff like this he broke it, and it was just from normal wear and tear because it was old. So I'm hoping maybe this year I could come across three or four step stools. I'm going to let him have one, and I'm going to keep one in my truck eventually. So he's got one for now. I was really thrilled that to find it yesterday in a really nice... Let me show you guys. Since you're in the dark and shit's going on, anyways, let me show you guys the nice, clean table I found. I want to show you guys this lamp. I don't think I've ever showed you guys this lamp before. And I want to show it to you. Look how beautiful that is. My boss was getting rid of a bunch of stuff. And I gave that one to my mother-in-law. And took the little smaller one upstairs. But that's absolutely beautiful. And I found this in the garbage before. Brand new. Little teddy bear. He lights up by his... He was brand new in the box. His ears, his paws, and his little paw, you know, his other paws, they all light up. Isn't he cute? Why would you throw him away? I don't get that, guys. You just never know what you can find. And he was brand new in the box, and so was this touch lamp, was my dad's. I found this little touch lamp. This was brand new in the box. It was, you know, I gotta clean it's dusty, and the bulb looks like it's going, I gotta put a new bulb, but that was brand new in the box, too. And so was this bear. Why would you throw... And nobody would have known. I just stopped to look in the box. And that's what I found. Lisa sharing life stories with you. Come with me tomorrow. I'm going to go grocery shopping. I'll show you some of the things I'm getting. Love you all. Please subscribe. I'm trying to do good for everyone. God bless. Bye.